Huzzah, folks, and welcome back to Daggerfall Unity. This, uh, Breton behind me just walked up to me and just started, like, impatiently waiting for me to move, but obviously I've been standing here in this court for, like, a while. I mean, I'm standing here so long that I got fucking hungry. Come on, what the fuck is this Breton doing? Hang on. You're fucking ruining my intro, bro. What is, what is it? Any news? The noble ruler Barbara Harding died of heart failure. Long live Guinevere Kingford, newly made Marquise of the Cambria. Eh, good for them. Um, leave me alone. Anyways, what up, everybody? We're here. We're back. We're hanging out. I think uh, today we're gonna we're gonna pack up. <clears throat> Excuse me. We're gonna pack up. Not the not the wagon or anything. We're just gonna go a couple towns down to the uh, that one big city or medium sized city that had a temple of Zenithar. That way we can do some fucking quests for our for our God Almighty. Um, yeah, let's just get into it. Uh, hello, sir. Let's turn my lantern off. Before I go though, <clears throat> let me fix this. I have a fucking slug in my throat. Bear with me. My wow order. I don't want to set a mark or anything. Mm. This looks pretty, um, pretty good. Can't switch to the ground. I guess I can't. Uh, and then ingredients. <clears throat> Let's remove this shit into the wagon. Actually, what's my gold level? Oh, wow, I'm, <laughs> I'm destitute. I'll have to live off my money out there. Actually, no. Where's my dragon horn? Dragon Horde. Give me, like, an extra 1,200, please. Thank you. Yeah, I can read these tomes. And I have some simple repair items. Yeah. Yeah. And you know what? Yeah, I feel good about that. Let's leave. Now, if memory serves correctly, when we were looking at the regional map, it was like... Deer Ridge Hollow or Bird Tree Commons that had the uh, the thing. And we're up here. We're at Daggerfall, Daggerfall. So if we just leave out the eastern exit, we'll be good. Western exit. Western exit. The Western exit. Look, it's already going the wrong way. And I took my fucking wagon with me. This horse, please. Let's get, get giddy up. <clears throat> Ah, uh, it's been a day or two since I played, so... It's just been about a week, I want to say, since I played, so... Hearing the music again is very comforting. And the rain. I, I've grown to really love the... Oh, I should learn... I should rest on, on what I've learned about jumping. That's always good. Yeah, it's been a couple days since... Or a couple weeks since I played. Maybe a week. And uh, it's nice being back. Oh, shit, look at this. So you see this style of building? Jake, uh, my friend Jake, aka uh, Genghis Khan, his uh, yurt in our Minecraft world is built just like this. And it looks so fucking dope. Looks so fucking dope. Oh, maybe he needs two cats on the outside. No, nah, I think he's more of a dog person than a cat person. <laughs> That'd be that'd be funny putting two little tabbies outside one of the corners of the uh, of the of the yurt that he made. Be fucking sick. It's funny that we ran across that. Also, where's the um? Hmm. Oh, it's way up there. Jeez. Good thing for auto run. There it is. Anything going on? Oops, oops, oops. 
I always forget what buttons disengage, auto run, and I always mess them up. All right. Let's head into the weast. Oh, I crack all the fingers in my in my uh, hand. Yeah, we just had a little minor Minecraft sesh. We're uh, jamming out for our boys' weekend coming up here soon. Today, That's what I was doing before this, I was making um, guard towers for the realm of the settlement of Wellspring, which I guess can be changed now from settlement to uh, the realm of Wellspring. Our uh, our world is upgrading. We're no longer a sediment. <laughs> a sediment. A set. A settlement. Jesus Christ! A sediment. So fucking bad. Oh, and that'll be more. In, that'll be more stuff for the uh, the history book in the city hall. Yeah, feels good when your city grows. It's like when your city finally gets that population level and civilization for you to like build your next amenity. You know, that's why. Like, that's why we built. We built like a a wonder, the Hippodrome of Wellspring. You know. <laughs> mm -mm. Nonsense on the road that want to deal me. The damage. Oh boy. You know what? I'm not going to stand for this. You, ma'am, have insulted my motherfucking honor. You want to fucking go? Bow to see a charge. Oh. Alright. Dismount. That was a good Picard maneuver, but the side swipes weren't working for me. I don't have the timing today. Spell sword, huh? Well, I can't carry all your junk. <clears throat> I guess I can just sell it all at the next town. Wherever. Probably a mistake picking that shit up. Oh, wait. I was hungry before I left. What am I doing? I'm acting a fool right now. First things first, get rid of that nasty orange. Let's use that tomato. Oh, speaking of tomatoes, we have our tomatoes planted in the ground. It's, uh, spring is quickly turning into summer over here. And, uh, uh, oh my god, excuse me. All the plants are exploding right now. We have, uh, what is it, 17, 20 varieties of blueberries? And most of them are already starting to fruit, which is absolutely crazy. We have a couple raspberry plants. They're flowering and starting to produce berries. Um, the fig tree is starting to produce figs. I don't even know if it's going to work out, though. The last two years, it hasn't produced shit. But I'm hoping that this year, since we're spiking it with a bit of fish furts, it's going gonna, it's gonna to take off. Um, but yeah, the tomatoes are in. We're doing purple Cherokees. We're doing red brandy wines. Those are two really good slicer tomatoes, so... You're going to want to use those on your BLTs with some nice thick-cut bacon, maybe some homemade mayo. Like, and I would even splurt a little, maybe a little swipe of Dijon mustard on there. You salt your tomatoes, get yourself some butter lettuce. Oh, ho, ho, ho. and you're talking about a great fucking BLT with those, with those two types of tomatoes, especially the red brandy one. We had those last year, and, and they were to die for. My mouth is like, it's like literally watering right now at the thought of, of sinking my teeth into a red brandy wine. Uh, but other than that, we have uh, there's two, we have four of those, two of each for those slicers. And we have five. Hold up, my, my brain's gotta, gotta work here. One, two, three, four. There's, then there's four San Marzans, your sauce tomatoes. And somehow we got a Romano. Uh, or a Romano. Roma, Roma, sorry, not Romano. Jesus, I'm thinking of Parmigiano, like, or uh, the Romano cheese. Jesus. Um, yeah, we got Roma tomatoes. I don't know how we got that. It's supposed to be all, all the rest is supposed to be San Marzan, but. Yeah, they're in the ground. Got some good mulch growing. Things are, things are spicing up in that department. It's looking good. Yeah, it's a bountiful harvest. All the hostas are coming in so strong. And there's these like hummingbird flowers that are really, really long and they like the tips flare out into these dramatic purple and white flowers. Um, got those. Uh, gardenia is blooming. Jasmine, star jasmine's blooming. Oh my god. It's a it's a full-on garden out there. 
And now that all these plantings are done, I can focus on the long-term summer project, which is finishing a couple retaining walls uh, by hand by laying some pavers, the, 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 what is it, the retaining wall pavers down and getting it all fucking set up right. Backbreaking labor and the continuing the ever endless but uh, and fill <laughs> of uh of segments of land oh hey hang on i'm so dumb okay not hungry water leave some shit behind yeah we're for we're for soldiering on ahead jesus soldiering on ahead Yeah, it's been fucking great. It's been a great a great summer for, for the garden this year. Oh yeah, the uh, what else is there? Some, there's some more plants that are doing really good. Or limelight hydrangeas, those are doing good. A rosemary plant is not doing well, and I don't understand why. Because it should be fine. It's an evergreen style bush, you know? Very perplexing. Um, uh, tell me, rumbles. They don't say, can't they? Yeah, it's going to be a bountiful summer. Like, I can't wait. Yeah, and we finished our full row of blueberries too for what we want in along the perimeter of our front lawn. Now probably do a couple rows of like bush bush blueberries or do like huckleberries or something like that in the middle. And then maybe after that, start getting fucking beehives going. Produce my own honey, make my own mead. Oh, that will be fucking sick. I have all the equipment for it. Although I need to buy another one of those, like, uh, what are they called? It's the copper tube that, uh, the copper coil that goes all the way down that attaches to your sink. And it, like, it allows you to, like, rapidly cool down your wart or whatever. It's for, uh, for use. I'll have to get one of those again. Other than that, I have everything else. Damn, can you imagine two? It'd they'd be like period batches, right? So every, every there'd be short meads, and there'd be one that'll be like dark raspberries, dark and can be raspberry with maybe black, maybe a couple blackberries in there. The blueberry huckleberry styles of mead. Jasmine and gardenia flowers for the bees to uh, feast upon. Ooh, I'm getting titillated thinking about it. Oh, water. I'm extraordinarily thirsty right now. So is this uh, where I need to be? No, this is Kinnereth and RK. <laughs> How am I doing? I'm a bit sleepy. Okay, I'll stay at an inn. I don't want to stay at the Fox and the Fairy because that seems like where I stayed last time. So let's see what these two are in the middle. The Laughing Dagger. And the flying skull. I'm doing the flying skull. That sounds sick. Oh boy. <clears throat> I always forget how loud it is in here. Let's have a peacock pie. Hold up. Put my snake, put my uh, gun away. Ooh, red wah. Oh, I need a room. Thank you, sir. Goodbye. Well, I'm only a bit sleepy, so let's do a couple hours of reading. Cool. And then until fully yield. Beautiful. Nice. Need more rest? Okay. Two more hours, please. How is that? Ah, oh, wonderful. Wonderful. 
Damn, did it put me in the tower again? <laughs> I love it when it does that. Hello, sir. Mmm. That cobbler supreme for the morning. With a mint tea. What is that? Fighters Guild? Yep. <clears throat> uh, where do I go from here? Okay. Keep heading east. Or west. Weast. I'm just gonna keep saying weast. Damn, that dome rock. Uh oh. Uh, down this way. I mean, if any of these towns have a temple to Zenithar, we'll stop and start, start doing quests for them. That'll be our temporary <sighs> home base. Excuse me. Nothing. Bank of Daggerfall. At least there's something. Oh, trying. Let's see who it's to. Looks like it's that that uh, that lady that's exposing her breasts. Yep. I like these shrines. I like how they're just outside of town too, like that, for travelers to stop at and pray. I'd like to see one for Zenithar. Oh, maybe if I, maybe it's the regional deity for this area. Like, I think it's RK specifically for Daggerfall, right? So, if I go to like, uh, what is it, Cairo or Cambria or um, uh, Totambu, is it going to be Zenithar? Could be. Hard to tell in Totambu. Th those jungles are fucking dense. I uh, I liked the region for the time we were there, but uh, I don't think I'll ever be going back. Sadly. <laughs> My reputation is sullied over there. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, hey, look at this. Archaeologist Guild, Mages Guild, Fighters Guild. Oh, this could be, this could be. Oops, wrong button. I just got so excited. Gear store, retail store, equipment store. <clears throat> what are you? Order of the hour. Okay, okay. I mean, if it's Zenny, it, we're staying. Come on, Iron Anvil. Iron Anvil. Lucky bird. Wrong way. A well. Oh. Fucking Kennereth place. The white dove and the onk. The weird onk. Order of the hour. Well, we continue. We hoped, we prayed, but alas, it was for naught. That could have been the Goldilocks zone. Could have been the the setoplex, if you know what I mean. <clears throat> oh my god! <laughs> Overcast to uh, partly cloudy, I suppose. <laughs> uh... mm, keep proceeding. A whist.
Yeah, we're heading out this weekend for a boys weekend out in the islands. It's gonna be a fucking fun time. I'm gonna be playing video. Vi I'm, I'm part of the crew that's that's there for relaxing. We're there to play video games and have obus foods, if you know what I mean. I signed up for breakfast on uh, the last day for my meal, and I'm making a hearty bacon and eggs for us gaming, and also for the boys that are going out on a hike. Yeah, I'm excited. Goob's got his uh, mister all dialed in with basically every fucking console known to man. <clears throat> just included PSX, which he didn't think was going to be attainable, but it is, which is even better. And, uh, I think I'm going to play Lands of Lore. I'm going to do a late night session of Lands of Lore for everyone to enjoy. Jake, you'll be especially excited about that. A Virgin Entertainment Interact- or no, what is it? Virgin Interactive Entertainment Presents a Westwood Studios production of Lands of Law, The Throne of Chaos. Old fucking Picard coming in strong with his beautiful voice. Holy shit. I'm excited. I'm fucking excited. I think I may play as Akshel, but we'll see. Kieran is always the obvious choice that you would want to go with, but... I may just do Akshel for the magic. Make it a little easier for me, because I know he's going to one-shot a lot of things with, like, what, Spark 3 or 4 or whatever. He, he can start out casting that super, super high. <clears throat> and then, of course, there's good old book No, I'm fucking excited. And we get to see old Victor... Excellent weapon! Oh, statues of past rulers adorn the main streets of the city. In Deer Ridge Hollow. <clears throat> this could potentially be uh, one of my towns that I need. Or that, that we, we want. Although, oh, I hope I make it in time before the, the, the gates go close. Oh, thank god. <clears throat> in our Minecraft world, we configured the gates and basically the town's walls like the Daggerfall city. So they close at night and open during the day. So I get locked out of out of the town all the time. Uh I have the Dragon Mages Guild and then right up there. Alice here too. Interesting. Maven the Wolf. Jacobius. Please jot that down. Ugh, Hinnerith. Disgusting. How am I feeling? Is it is it sleepy time? No, but I could eat. Hey, old champion. Very fine scales. I'll have the salmon steak supreme with a wonderful, wonderful glass mold wine. Oh shit! Got the old crone. Get out of here before the gates close. Be on our way. So it's not this place. It must be Berg Tree Commons. So let's leave out the southern exit. Or go go along the southern road. Hopefully there's not going to be a wall around this town. It looks like a medium city, so... Let's hope. Make our foothold and get set up. If it ain't Berg Tree Commons, we might have to pull the wiki up. I am noticing these little smaller towns. There's like a wide array of different uh, 
deities in this province. Daggerfall specifically. You don't I don't think you really see that ever everywhere else, right? There's some provinces where it's like you're always gonna see an RK, right? Wait, what is this? Long Witch something? Long Witch End? What do you got here? <clears throat> Nothing. Good day, sir. I think it's east, right? Yeah. Damn, the ocean over there. <clears throat> when we get up on, onto this this hill, I'll stop and we'll, we'll see what the ocean looks like. Oh, yeah. Oh. Hello. What's that? Pirates. Nah, those are just, that's just the port. Look at those buildings. Damn. I like that boat design. Cute. Okay. Beautiful. Oh, was that it? I think I saw the town in, in amongst the trees. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Mm, this could be, this could be it. This could be it. Kinnereth, maybe. <clears throat> yeah, see, Kinnereth's everywhere in this province, but there's like it seems like there's a, a more variety, uh, a wider variety of secondary temples and towns. And if this boy is Zenithar over here, that kind of proves my point. In fact, kind of looks like Zenithar, right? <clears throat> Oh, yeah, see? It's a resolute. Beautiful. Here's our town. Deerbridge, Deerbridge Hollow. Deerbridge Hollow? Bergtree Commons. Bergtree Commons. Okay. Let's spend the rest of the night. Let's identify all these buildings. <clears throat> and then we will uh, we'll pick an, an inn to stay in. And then we'll go from there. Who are you? The Dancing Rascal. Bargain Wares, Theodric's Gear Store. But Lord Theodric. Oh, look at this. Look at this. A place of learning. Nice little, like, amphitheater. Little, little thing, amphitheater type thing. The Rat and the Bird. Missed the store over here. Ungeons. I mean, this is obviously a fighter's go. Oh my god, that geeky. The dirty stag, I like it. I love it. Flying jug. Silver ogre, the gold helm, bat and the scorpion. Um, that just leaves this little smidge here. The schmear. Oh, I said schmear. I could really go for uh, <clears throat> an everything bagel with cream cheese. Toasted. Emperor's wares. Okay. Sundries, equipment. What are you? Incubellium. What's this? The Howling Griffin. Okay. I mean, it's the Dirty Stag, right? Or the Gold Helm. I like the Gold Helm as well. The Gold Helm feels like super noble to me. Dirty Stag. I mean, we have to. 
Bobby, it's it's after Bobby B. You know what I mean? The dirty stag. He's plowing everybody's mistress. He was the king after all. Old tail thick of the misery sausage. <laughs> uh, let me just have goat's milk, please. <clears throat> cool, we got a room. I'm just gonna read tonight, I think. Oh my, oh. Oh, sir. Sir, you have a fine, fine kitchen. Oh, wow. Look at all the, so much fish. Must be a fish sausage, that's why it's mystery meat. Damn, you look like you look pretty fucking important. Minstrel over here with his tight pants. This lady, this traveling woman. Oops, that's the outside. That's the kitchens. So these are the rooms then. Wow. What's the other room look like? Oh, howdy, sir. <laughs> This guy right here, this this image right here, it literally brought a flashback to my mind of the uh, the intro for Morrowind, where you do the questionnaire with the old man and shit like that. It's literally what it reminded me of right there. I'm well rested. I am well fed. I am well drunk, drank, hydrated. Yeah. Let's read. Mysticism, thaumaturgy, and alteration. Alteration, mysticism, and thaumaturgy. Alteration, illusion, and destruction. Okay, four ought to do. Yeah, that was a, a good amount. Wow, and it, it uses my mana too. I didn't even realize that until just now. We'll sleep for a solid ten. Oh, you wake up. Beautiful. I'm dependable. Uh, level. Zero percent. Mysticism, restoration. And then the rest are all misc, yeah. <clears throat> These are the ones that just leveled. Even jump did well. Nice. Uh, let's leave. But first... Mystery is sausage. And uh, we'll just have an ale to go with that today. Thank you, sir. Go to see you. Oop, no wagon. <clears throat> Round. Alright, before we depart, or start, start doing this Zenithar quest. Oh god, I'm hitting every wrong button. I want to do a little shopping. I'm going to hit all the stores. And then we're gonna go see what's up. <clears throat> Wanna restock on food. Actually, I'll sell my junk to this dude. Yeah, see, food. Hey, buddy. I can sell this. Oh, and these. That. <clears throat> I guess that's it. The tomats. How am I doing on lantern oil? 15? That's, that's more than enough. user. <clears throat> Damn, what was that? Gager Shortbow. Dope. I think I say that every time I see it. Oh! This flower right here! Oh, that's not quite. That's not quite the hummingbird flower I was talking about. That one has more like downward facing like trumpets or whatever, you know? Anybody have food? Holy shit. 
pathetic loaves of bread and at least I'm getting bandages. Here we go. This is the mother load. Thank you. And this place is a uh, po. Deadly. Hmm? Hmm. The old longsword. If we're playing Dark Souls 1, I'd be all about a plus 10 longsword. But alas, this is not Dark Souls 1. Um, get these guys, and then we go to the Zen. We go to the center of Zenithar studies. Also, is this a... Oh, no. Am I wet? I am not wet. Oh, is this finally one? Oh, no way! It's a finally a fucking crypt dungeon! I've been wanting to fucking do one of these forever. Go. Oh. It's been a while since we've, uh... We've done one of these. Oh, how quaint a spoder. Am I okay? Oh, I am wet. I am wet. I can't rest out here, so we'll just uh, make quick work of this. Yeah, I'll take that. Take all this shit. Sell to that. Uh, I'll sell it to somebody. Fucking crypt. I love it. Sound like a zombler in there? Oh! Oh, it's a mum! Back it up. Back it up, you bag of bones. Oh my god. Oh my god, how strong are mummies? Oh my god. Eh, a little bit of coin right there, I will say that. We got another mum. I think they're susceptible to fire. Do I have fire? I don't. Yes, I am aware that the cold is seeping into my bones, game. Don't have to worry about that. I am well aware that I am freezing to death. Hey, there was a lot of money in here. And that was a dungeon I did not read. No secret passages? Negative. Alright, my rule of thumb for these is I only hit them once. The RP being, we hit it once and we know that we've cleared it of the, of the evil that is in that crypt. We are victorious. That's cool, that's our first graveyard dungeon, I can't believe it. I never thought I would see one, to be honest. Like, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm actually pretty shocked right now. Oh, look at, look at this guard's armor. Wow. Wow. Hail, sir. Any fucking news? Barfden has ascended to the throne, is the new baron. And is the new baron. May, Lar uh, <laughs> may Long may Farfden rule over Abadogora. Okay, I don't know where that area is. Must be a town or something like that. Oh, fucking cool sprite. It's called a sprite, right? God, I'm dumb. <laughs> Alright, store here. I hope this gear store is going to be a pawn shop and rusty. Lame. Are there are no pawn shops in this place? Probably bought way too much food, but I'll live with that. 71 bandages. We're going up in in, uh, in those, which is nice. I'm not buying any more food. Just bandages. What was that? 
Oh, that has a dragon on it. It was those straps that I was looking at. Alright. Let's go stop at an inn. Dancing Rascal. Dry off. Then we will head over to Zenithar. Uh... Do you not have a fire? Hmm. Well, that's a problem. Uh, rat and the bird, I guess. Here, a fire. Ah, here we go. Uh, for I have not rented a room here. Oh, I'm, I think I'm fine. Maybe I changed out of all everything and it did the trick. Grilled hair. Apple cider. Resolute of Zen. Here we come. Horrid quality. Oh my god. Here, let me... um. I think from now on I'm going to do a, what is it called, recall out here, anchor, cool, save the game, let's see here, uh, what do I want to call this, Zenny1, I'm going to spell it all out today, hello, 100 please, <clears throat> Hello, sir. That lousy some that lousy someone has been spreading rumors that I need help. I don't need any help in anything. Oh my god, what? <laughs> what? I've never seen that before. What the fuck was that? Uh <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. They tell me that you quite loyal to the temple. I need you to perform a vital task for us. Zenithar has become angry with us. You need to not concern yourself with why. Our only hope is to build or is to hold a rite of atonement. We need troll's blood for the ceremony. My sources tell me that some can be found in Castle Hawkwing. Will you bring it to us? Yeah. The ceremony must be held within seven days. The temple will reward you with 563 gold for this. Only untainted troll's blood will do. Xenathar's blessing is upon you so that you will know when you find it. Huh, okay. This, is, this seems simple enough. This seems simple enough. Let's save the game. Zenny 2. Zenny 2, the quest for troll blood. What was it called again? <laughs> uh, Rite of Atonement. Castle Hawkwing. Oh, okay. No. Castle Hawkwing is yonder. I am yonder. So off road up to Caraway Rock and then off road up to Castle Hawkwing. Easy. But we're going to do that next episode because I just realized that we are over time. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I'm glad we finally got to a, a Zenithar place. Interesting dialogue when we started that. That was kind of funny. Uh, yeah, we'll pick it up next time. We'll hit the road and we will head up to... Uh, head up to old castle hawkwing and find this fucking pure trolls blood for the ceremony we can't have zenithar being mad at us you know we we gotta be we gotta be on his good side here come on we can't be fucking around let's get let's get fucking real here anywho adios people <laughs>